Lil Peep, an emerging singer, rapper and YouTube star whose debut full-length album dropped in recent months, has died according to multiple reports. The Long Beach, New York-raised emo hip-hop artist, real name Gustavar, was just 21 years of age. Reasons for his passing have not been revealed, though British broadsheet The Guardian cites a suspected overdose. Lil Peep had a promising career in front of him. His star had been on the rise since 2015 via a series of SoundCloud tracks, apps, and mixtapes, and he enjoyed full traction through his YouTube channel, where his videos to Awful Things, Ben's Truck, The Bright Side and others clocked up multiple millions of views as the buzz built, Peep signed with agent Kara Lewis, and enthusiastic features followed in Fader, Noisy, and Pitchfork, which declared him as the future of emo. In an extensive three-part profile, Medium wrote, It's obvious Peep is going to blow up. All the while, the conversation rumbled on about whether he was a rapper or a singer. Was he hip-hop or emo? Peep showcased all those skills on his debut album, Come Over When You're Sober, which dropped on September 1st. The Peep army was of growing one, as fans tuned in en masse for his refreshing candor about his battles with depression, heartbreak, drug use and his sexuality. A slew of recorded artists paid tribute to the young performer, from Post Malone to Marshmello, Rich Chiga and many more. Peep was the nicest person. Hanging out with him, talking to him about music, the song ideas we were going to do together, and touring was so amazing, tweeted Marshmello. Everyone will miss you man. Billboard has reached out to reps for Lil Peep. More to come.